Going back to Psalm 46 again on this fine morning, verses 4 through 7. There is a river, the streams whereof shall make glad the city of God, the holy place of the tabernacles of the Most High. God is in the midst of her, she shall not be moved. God shall help her, and that right early. The heathen raged, the kingdoms were moved. He uttered his voice, the earth melted. The Lord of hosts is with us. The God of Jacob is our refuge. This passage of scripture has always brought me a sense of calm in a storm. Years ago, my wife and I were uh, gifted a week at some friend's camp on Upper Wilson Pond up in Greenville, Maine. This was a fine, fine week. The spring weather was balmy and the temperatures were mild. And I remember taking the canoe and my wife and I decided to paddle down the stream to Laura Wilson Pond. We drifted along, not even talking, just being together. As we drifted, we saw on the shore, not 15 feet away, a mother loon on the nest. She never moved as we quietly went past. I remember paddling back and keeping to the far shore as we returned. That sense of calm, that, that idyllic sense is what comes to mind as I read this passage. You know, it goes from raging waters of life to the description of what God, my refuge, longs to give me. Rest in Him. In Him. He said it, Well, come to me, all you who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Are you in a raging storm of life? Run to the refuge and say, I can't do this. Please grant me trust and peace. And then remember, there really is a river. The chorus to an old song comes to mind. There is a river that flows from God above. There is a fountain that's filled with his great love. Come to the waters. There is a vast supply. There is a river that never shall run dry. You ponder that, Pastor Steve. <laughs>